Oh, sorry guys, we're back. Yeah, like I'm not doing this playthrough like perfectly, but like I'm not sure we, we were recording that last bit, but we just picked up a story record like right here. You remember how like, a couple episodes ago we talked to uh, Aruka Sensei like right around here? Yeah, and like I literally like, um, I don't know if I showed everything off screen, but I, uh, you know, exited the sand, uh, did a bunch of vlogging for about 20 minutes, and now we're here. So, but this is the main uh, uh, note to self. This is the main series. Excuse me, episode. Uh, by the way, uh, in the last episode, I let you guys know we are drinking a cherry coke. So, also sorry about these shortcuts and the video issues. Um, has it zoomed in yet? No, it has not. Thank. Thankfully, thankfully, but I'm keeping an eye on the, uh, how zoomed in it is, you know, uh, yeah, yeah, sorry about the last, uh, pretty sure I made this apology in the bonus episode, but, well, I might as well make it here, so, yeah, I checked out some of the, uh, <laughs> uh quality, quality control, let's say, and, uh, and that was pretty weird, yeah, last episode, uh, we saw that it was all, like, zoomed in on that one part, Pretty freaking weird, man. Not gonna lie, not gonna lie. So, uh, yeah, we're watching everything this episode. I'm literally sitting right behind the camera. And I'm looking at everything. I'm looking at, uh, any, any kind of weird zoom, any, uh, I'm looking at everything. I'm looking at how it's off, off tilt, how it's, you know, slightly ajar. <laughs> Let's save it. Oh, oops. Uh, oh. Oh, or you would, but you don't have a door. Uh, yeah, huh? Uh, okay, well, anyway. We did find more cursed dolls, so... Uh, but yeah, let's save here out of, out of an, an abundance of caution. Uh, because I don't know if my phone is going to cooperate. So, basically, there's going to be a lot of dialogue here. Let's hope for the best, guys. Pray for me. Pray that, uh... Everything's just fine. That the uh, we don't get any weird zoom in or anything, anything weird. Well, I guess if we do, I can just kind of reset and pretend this episode never happened. Bonus episode, you know. Hey, hey, Shikamaru. Uh, yeah, you could say that. In fact, you could say Gara's been to uh, hell and back. Well, I mean, did he? Did I, like I never watched this part of the anime. Okay. But, like, here in Ninja Storm 2, they make it seem like Gara died. Um, so did Naruto just be like, hey, man, you know, after, like, the, the third great ninja war and uh, Obito and all that, did he ever go to Gara and just be like, hey, man, what's the afterlife like? Yeah, just curious, you know. <laughs> like, like, what? That's a pretty... I don't know if Kishimoto ever... Uh, that sounds like a funny piece of dialogue. Uh, Chun exempt, right? Shikamaru's higher up on the ladder. He's kind of insulting us. Yeah, it's, uh... Anyway, I haven't checked up here since we've been back, so... Allow me to just do that. Um, there may be somebody important up here that I haven't talked to. Oh! Dude, I was totally kidding. Hello, Jiraiya. <laughs> now I've I've done some splendid uh, research. Now I can flesh out a rough draft for my next uh, novel. <laughs> oh, you guys in Twitch chat know what I'm talking about. Kek W. <laughs> oh, um, hmm, you're back, Naruto. While you were working hard out there, I was doing plenty of my own good work. Wink, wink. <laughs> and many ways. <laughs> now, I know my voice sounds nothing like Jiraiya, but the inside jokes shall remain. So, <laughs> hope you guys like my Jiraiya voice for the entire playthrough. Uh, get ready for it to change radically from chapter to chapter because, well, you know, I, what, it was fun fact about all my series, right? So, I hear complaints about this voice and this voice and this voice, but the, here's a little trick. Basically, I do the voice bad the first time, the first, you know, the first episode you hear it. And then, basically, what I do is I type in Google, right? I go to my YouTube, and I'll literally Google, like, oh, Jiraiya first encounter with Naruto. And then I'll watch the episode in English dub, because I'm a sub-watcher, so that's kind of the reason for the bad voices. Uh, but I'll watch it in dub, like, 30 times. 
and that, and then I'll be able to do the guy voice, you know, onward lead with the power of the youth. You see, you see. Yeah, you, you watch it in 30 times, then you, you get it. It's, 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 it's locked in, man. It's locked in. Anyway, Hokage's room, we need to speak to this person, but first... Oink, oink. Oink, oink. Hi, Tauntaun. Hello. Oink, oink. I love Tauntaun. Hello. <laughs> uh... Oh, she wants... Ah, oh, okay, Shizune. Shizune <laughs> letting us know the down low on how... Grandma Tsunade really feels about our, you know, progress. Which, I mean, uh, you know, we did kind of, you know, revive a, a Kazikage from the, yeah, yeah, our chakra helped. Mm-hmm. Anyway, let's talk to this uh, person, and we will get some Grandma important sti story dialogue. So I will, shh, be quiet. Naruto, you're back, are you? We're not zoomed in, are we? Okay. We're still recording, right? Oh. Hey, so... Got any new missions? Sorry, guys, I gotta check everything. Yeah, what's up? Any new missions? But you just got here. Shouldn't you rest? I did. On the way back. It took me like three days to get here. Come on, man. I rested plenty. That's why I've got so much energy. Bingo, buddy. You're really something else. Uh, is she insulting us? So, do you, do you have any missions? Hmm. Honestly, hold on a minute. I'll have Shizune check. So, I don't think this is a main mission, but, uh, yeah. Here we go. Kind of a side quest. An easy Let's one. Let's see. We have just one mission that Naruto could handle. Uh, what's up? Need me to find a lost kid? We did that last episode. Or was that two episodes? Uh, anyway. What's up? Great. I'm on it. Yeah. Believe it. How was that? No, no. Believe it. Believe it, believe it, believe it, believe it, believe it, believe, believe, delete, 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 believe it. Uh, a certain match. Somebody looking for a lighter? Because I've got a fire in my pocket, and I've got the fire, the wheel of Konoha. That's my ninja. The Wheel of Fire. I can provide a match, believe it. Cherry Blossom Crash, man. Fireball Jutsu. Uh. Ah, uh, I see. Mm, at least we get some Miracle Ink. Okay, I'll accept it. Yeah, sure, sure. Uh, yeah. Oh, oh, they're not reading the dialogue. Uh, you're going to be partnered up with some Chunin. That could be a handful for you as a Ginnin. Hmm. Uh, no problem, believe it! It's true that I'm still a Ginnin, but I'm not so weak I can't go to toe-to-toe -to -to with your average Chunin, believe it! Uh, <laughs> Tsunade doesn't seem so sure. Huh. huh, I suppose you're right. In that case, good luck on your mission. Put your all into it, Naruto. I will! I never give up, that's my Nindo! My ninja way, believe it! Hmm, eh, that was good enough. All right, so that's it for the dialogue. So let's talk to Tauntaun, the official Hokage. Oink, oink. Yeah, you said it, Tauntaun. Uh, get moving. Okay, I'm moving. What? No, <laughs> let's talk to Shizune. Uh, okay, okay. I thought she might give us more info on the the mission. You know, as far as who needs assistant training. But uh, I guess we're just gonna wing it and go to the training field. Okay. Well, let's go. Uh, oh, our luck is still up. I guess I could have checked those uh, barrels, but uh, oh, there's another mission here. Sweet old coin. Okay, what's this? All right, let's talk to this guy. Pick up another mission. Yeah, it's basically the side quest hour. So, just letting you guys know, the next uh, five episodes, maybe more. It's gonna be like filler. Yes. Yeah, so. uh, whoa. Uh, let's give this guy the uh, Pokemon voice. Whoa, magnificent. Do you have ninja tools? I mean, Pokemon? Huh, magnificent. Uh, hey, old man, what are you wondering about? Believe it, you're kind of freaking me out. Huh, I'm actually a ninja tool maniac, also known as a Pokemaniac. Do you know about Pokemon? No? Well, allow me to talk to you about ninja tools. See, we have these thing called Pokeballs, which, uh, da -ba -da -ba -da. oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm, believe it. 
Come to think of it, you look like a Pokemaniac. So that means you must naturally use Pokeballs. AKA Ninja Tools. Uh, yeah, believe it. Every ninja needs Pokeballs. Believe it. Uh, in that case, won't you grant my wish? I wish to see lots of Pokeballs. I want to see Pokeballs, Great Balls, Love Balls, Friend Balls, Moon Balls, and Ultra Balls, as well as Master Ball. Oh, if you come across the Master Ball. Oh, Pokemon. Uh, yeah, so this guy's, uh, yeah, asking to see 10 different Ninja Tools. So there you guys go. That's why I've been buying the Ninja Tools. Yeah, here and there. So, but we get 30,000 Rio. Basically meaning he'll refund you for the ninja tools you've paid for. You should probably take the request. Guess I can't refuse. Believe it. Sure, I'll help you. Wow. Uh, whoa, believe it. Thank you. I mean, um, Pokemon. Uh, right. Yeah. Bring some new ninja tools. Yeah. So, pretty, uh, yeah, when you got 10, show them. So... All right, and this kind of is just kind of a tutorial on where to buy ninja tools. We've already done this in like the last couple episodes, but let's see. Let's just talk to him, see how many we've got. Uh, oh, well, there we go. Easy mission. Oh, oh, no, wait, wait. How many do we have exactly? Let's pull up our items and check. So we've got one, two, three, four. Uh, one, two, three, four. Five, six. Okay. So, yeah, we will need a lot more. Um, some Oban or Koban would help. But, uh, let's see what's this. Oh! We got... <laughs> How about that? Capricious. Hmm. Got the item. Jackpot Lottery. So, some of you may have been wondering... Floodmon 14. Why are you like obsessively checking for items? So uh, there's like a 1% chance, much like in real life, for you to win the jackpot lottery. And guess what, guys? We literally just hit the jackpot. So, yep, looks back to normal. But if you go in here, this is awesome. <laughs> what a good episode. So, yeah, about a 1% chance. Uh, you may have worse or better luck. Uh, this also gives you an achievement, so go for that if you want. But, yeah, if you go to sell, <laughs> check out the jackpot lottery. Yeah, 50,000. You literally just won the jackpot. Yeah. So we're going to be selling that. I mean, there's no other use for it. You can't, like, trade it. You can't, you know. I mean, just sell it, man. Just sell it and smile and enjoy the Chivo. Now, we will buy the exhaustion tag just so we have another ninja tool. And the sluggish. I don't normally use these, but that does give us enough Rio for the poison tag. So that's great. I love poison tag. Um... Now, will that give us 10? I don't think so. But in the meantime, let's buy a couple of these uh, ninjutsu reference books. Let's buy one and double back and go give it to Jiraiya Sensei. Uh, orderless? Do I have anything that I can turn in? Yeah, these are all ninja tools, by the way. Yeah, like the food pill, etc. Yeah, I so. Um, I don't think... We may have to wait until we have... Yeah, like the sleep tag. Yeah, and the, this is why I was looking for the black gold. For the kunai with the rain. Yeah, because I knew this request was eventually in the game. But, uh, yeah. So, until we get the black gold, I'm not so sure we can fulfill the, uh, the 10. But just basically, every time you buy a ninja tool, just check with this guy and, you know... Oh! Hey, mister, I collected 10 ninja tools. Believe it. Uh, wow. Pokemon, I've been waiting for this. Let's see all those Pokeballs. The man stares adoringly at the ninja tools. Oh, wait, I can read this in the Dragon Ball Z announcer voice. The man stared adoringly at Naruto's display of the ninja tools on Dragon Ball Z. Ah. Uh. This one, this Pokeball, and that Pokeball, and the other Master Ball, and I see the Love Ball goes. Yes, Pokeballs, I love them. And yeah, this guy's request is fulfilled. One hour later, two hours later, 
so much later that they had to fire the old narrator. Hey, why was I fired by now to me on Dragon Ball Z? That they had to fire the old narrator and hire a new one. Oh my, I've had such a great time seeing Pokeballs! <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, sure. Uh, thank you for giving me this pleasure of seeing Pokeballs! By that I mean Ninja Tools! Now I'm satisfied! Wah! And there we go. We did it, guys. Yo! Oh. And we get 30,000 Rio. Pretty much worth it. Uh, so that's why I was picking up like carrots. And you remember at the start of the episode, uh, last episode, the bonus episode, I was like, yeah, I'm gonna pick up these high, high sell items. You know, and that's just in case we don't uh, win the lottery. You know, we've got a backup plan. We sell carrots for a living, and we're like professional ninjas. That's my plan. That's my ninja. My ninja way, man. I'm picking up carrots, and I'm dropping them at the market. I'm a ninja. Anyway, let's go up to Jiraiya Sensei and give him this book. Because he seems to like books a lot. Like a lot, a lot. So, oh, these items have for stocks. Eh, they're just soybeans. Anyway, hey, uh, Pervy Sage. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, wait. He doesn't want a reference book? Uh, I'm sorry, what? Wait, 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 wait. I, like, remember giving him one, though, right? And I did buy one, yes? And then Jutsu... I did! He doesn't want one? Oh, right! He doesn't want it until later. I totally forgot about that. So it's kind of weird that you can't, uh... Hmm. I guess we'll give it to Shikamaru, I guess. Hey, Shikamaru. What's up, bro? Uh, wait, he doesn't want one either? Odd. Huh. I don't know. Who's next? Uh, Choji? <laughs> I, I don't know who we're gonna run it. Oh, I guess I can give one to Rock Lee. Yeah. There's a pachinko ball. They'll sell for okay the amount of money. Uh, oops. I'm trying to pick up this item, bro. Let's get you, bro. Just need to uh, get past you. How's the bucket up? Uh, oh, wait. There's Awesome Sensei. Uh, does he want a book? Hey. Hey, what's up, Nar uh, Awesome? Uh, yeah. Oh, he doesn't want a book either? What's going on here? Um, whatever. I guess some of these guys don't want a book until later? Odd. Uh, nice. Ernest. Nice. Another title. Um, let me check something here. Check members. Check. Yeah, that's what I need to check. Yeah. So this is what the reference books are for, by the way. Ah, so I haven't given one to Rock Lee, huh? Hmm. Okay. Be right back. Hmm. Because Rock Lee likes to hang out over here, right? I remember from the, uh, <laughs> the, uh, Fielder episode. Yeah, there he is. What's up? Uh, you want a book? Uh, yeah, here we go. All right, yeah, buddy. It's all yours. All right, friendship level one acquired. That is important for a certain uh, side quest, let's say. Okay. All right. On we go. Uh, I think I'll find the nearest save point, guys, because quite honestly, getting the jackpot lottery, that itself is good enough for an episode, if I'm being quite frank. Um, so yeah, again, sorry for another filler. I realize we didn't get much done this episode. Well, then again, we kind of did. So let's recap the episode. We uh, won the lottery. We uh, fulfilled that guy's request for our Pokeballs uh, Ninja Tools. And we also got to fire the Dragon Ball Z announcer and hire a completely new narrator after a whole year. You know, the SpongeBob meme. So, Pretty successful episode. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But in the, I will, I will like uh, head back to the title screen here. But all jokes aside, I am going to, uh, in the interest of time, just kind of, you know, cut to the front of the village and uh, meet you guys there in the next episode. So I don't know how long this recording will go on or whatever, but that's the plan. Feel free to leave the episode now. The episode has officially ended. So yeah. 
Oh, another request here. Um, strike that, reverse it. Uh, what's up? Are, are we still recording? Have we zoomed in? Okay. What's up? Oh, oh. <sighs> what a mess. I can't believe we wound up with this much trouble. Huh? Hey, 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 what's with the clump faces? Believe it! Something happened? Huh? Uh, not really too, huh? Yeah. We, uh, got a certain request from the fifth Hokage, but it's so hard to work up the motivation. Hmm. Motivation? What's the request for? Believe it! Hmm, searching for... Uh, say it. I don't want to say it. Pig pearls. Huh? Searching for pig pearls? Believe it! The heck? The fifth Hokage's pet. Hmm, Tantan, isn't it? Her pearls have been stolen. We've been ordered to go search for them. But the bothersome part is Tantan wanders everywhere. So we have no idea where to start looking. Uh, right. Naruto? Uh, yeah, according to the Hokage, they're a replica. The real ones were kept safe, with each pearl having a pig mark on them. We suspect someone has stolen the, the pearls. It's Light Yagami. He's watching you right now. But, but, per pearls with a pig mark on them? And Tata and Wersos? Haha, <laughs> believe it! It's not funny. Apparently, each pearl was specially made, and they're very valuable. And the Hokage wants them. Hmm. Well, the best way to solve this is to catch a crew who did this and make them talk, right? Believe it! Hmm, no. We've already caught the criminal. Oh! Ah ha ha ha! Only. Yeah, listen to human. It's just a crow who loves shiny objects. Which is a problem since crows fly everywhere. Ah, huh? a crow! The criminal was a crow! Believe it! You sure it wasn't Itachi? Uchiha? Believe it! Maybe he was spying on the hidden leaf! Believe it! Uh, apparently they like to collect shiny things. You can't exactly interrogate the bird about where it dropped the pearls. Well, that's kind of the mess we're in. And even worse, as they were being stolen, the stream which held the pearls together broke. So the pearls flew in all directions. You know what this sounds like? Inuyasha. Kagome, you know, she latches the crow foot onto the sacred arrow. You know, hit the mark. And then, like, because it's attached to the crow, it, like, locks on. And the Shikon Jewel breaks, shatters, and Shikon Jewel shards are created and are, like, split in a, a billion different directions. It sounds like you guys stole this from the plot of Inuyasha, and I have one thing to say for you, Ninja Storm. Well done. You didn't say Shikon Jewel Shard, therefore it's original content, and you haven't stolen anything. I've always been suspicious of you, Kotetsu, and well, I can tell you that you're clear of suspicion. We will remove the surveillance cameras and the bugs from both Light Yagami and the director, director deputy's households. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Shikon Jewel Shard, blah, blah, blah. We know the plot. Uh, yeah. So, 30 pearls. I'm pretty sure Kagome and Inuyasha found. Oh, let's just say about. 999 Shikon Jewel Shards, so this should be relatively easy, right? And... No. Alright, alright, believe it. I'll just. I see how hard it is, but I'll do what I can to help. Believe it. He will. Oh, thank goodness. I'm thrilled. Can't you tell? Ha! Now that I'm out of the case, it's as good as done. Believe it. Just you watch. <laughs> well, well. I'm glad to see you so confident, <laughs> but let me warn you, we don't have any clues where to start. You'll just have to hunt carefully. Hmm. It was a crow, Itachi's crow. He's using a special jutsu, so the pearls won't have gone inside buildings, so we can scratch that off our list of places to search at least. But I warn you that... 
Sure, sure. How many pearls are we talking about anyway? Believe it. Uh, that's sad. What was it? Hmm. 30? That'll be, that'll do. 30 per person, okay. Ah, so there are about 90-ish. You know. So basically 100. Okay, I'm on it. Believe it. Uh, anyway. Hmm. Let's start searching for pearls. Next thing you know, we're gonna be searching for diamonds. And maybe even platinums. Pokemon jokes. <coughs> anyway. When you've collected a few, bring them to me. Hmm. Uh, when we've got 30 each, or so, we'll report to the 5th Hokage. Don't overdo it. Guys, just collect them, little by little. Alright. And we've got one of the most difficult requests of the game fulfilled. Hey, what's up, Sakura? Oh, oh, Sakura's talking. We all know what that means. Time to mute the TV. Yep. Okay, okay, she's done talking. All right, there we go. Anyway, guys, that's going to be it for this episode <laughs> of Naruto. Uh, she put in, uh, too. Sorry, just had to, you know, do something with my TV there real quick. But, uh, yeah, in the next episode, we will, uh, we, oh, we've got a pearl. Well, hey, there you go. All right. One down, uh, 999 to go. Anyway. See you guys next time. I'm just gonna save Epoo right here. Uh, I guess next we'll head to the training field? I don't know. Uh, maybe I should have waited to double back to the sand village. I bet we find a lot of pearls on the way there. Huh. Eh, whatever. I'll see you guys next time. In the meantime, I'm gonna jump over people. hi -ya! Believe it! Believe it! I'm the fastest ninja alive. And I will jump until the episode ends. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Bye, guys. I'm having way too much fun in this game. Uh, wait, did we, did we zoom in? Hang on. Let me see my... Uh, no. no. I think we're good. Hey, kid. Hey, 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 hey. I can beat you. Believe it. I'm the fastest. Believe it. I'll catch up to you. Ha-ha. <laughs> All right. Bye, guys. <laughs>